I can because I'm capable. I will because I'm strong. I must because they're dependent on me. Don't you sit here and act like you've reached all your level of success. No, you have not. You have not begun to see the things that's about to happen to you. Never ever, never ever, never, 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 never ever give up on your dream. Listen to me, that mental picture, never let it die out. Never ever let it die out. I don't care how much time passed. I don't care what happens, circumstances, situations. I don't care what de defeats, what upsets. I don't care what happens in your life. Listen to me and listen to me very carefully. You better never, ever, ever, never, ever give up on your dream. Never let the mental picture, the picture that you painted, listen to me. Whatever you saw, whatever you said you were going to accomplish, whatever you said you were going to do, never ever, I know, I know repetition deepens the impression. Never ever, never ever, ever, never let your dream die. I can. Because I can. I will. Because I'm strong. I can get through any obstacle on my way to my journey. I must, because they count on me. Don't give up, don't give up on your dreams. Don't go, go pick it back up. There's a dream you left two, three years ago. Somebody told you you couldn't do it and you internalized that foolishness. Stop listening to the haters, shut them down, shut them up. You wanna shut your haters up, how do you do it? You do it by being successful. You don't do it by falling into their traps, doing what they want you to do, put your head down. You don't do it by not being successful. Let me tell you what I learned. Nothing succeeds like success. And so pick your dream back up. Pick your goals back up. Kill a, kill, kill a noise. Shut them down. And surround yourself with people who will help you, who will help you, who will speak life into you and not death. People who will speak life into you and help you to get from where you are to where you want to be. It's your boy, E.T. Remember, remember, I don't care nothing about your past. Because I got one too. Listen to me, you have the opportunity right now to make the rest of your life the best of your life. I must. Because it's going to be harder for them to do it if I don't do it. I must. Because I got to break that cycle. It's not going to break itself. I must. I must. I must. Because they count on me. Listen to me. We're all human. We're all growing. None of us are evil because we're not doing what we said we were going to do. But at some point, you have to embrace. Be fruitful. Multiply. Have dominion. And subdue the world. Let's go, y'all. You have gone too far. You've invested too much time. You've given too much to quit now. You put too much time into it, too much effort. You've cried too many tears, right? You've gone, you've gone without eating. You have, you have invested too much to walk away at this point, all right? So we all in, baby. Now it's time to get the reward. It's about momentum. You gotta keep it 100. You gotta be true to you. And I'm tired of people emailing me, telling me what somebody told them they can't and can't do. Listen to me. The only thing you need to write your book, the only thing you need to do to finish the GED, I'm telling the book now, I'm telling the book. The only thing you need to do to get your four-year degree, the only thing you need to do to get your master's, the only thing you need to do is get your PhD, that is to believe in your dreams and stop listening to others. You're about to get certain things just because of the effort you put in, the time you put in. You're about to get a reward. Are you hearing me? You're about to get a reward, baby. So don't quit, don't give up. There's some blessings that come in life after regulation. They come in overtime. They come in extra innings. So for some of y'all, you're gonna have to learn to wrestle with it. You're gonna have to learn to fight with it. That's what wrestling means. That's what I'm talking about. You're gonna have to put in a little bit more sweat, a little bit more blood, a little bit more tears, but you gotta wrestle with it. I'm not going to let you go until you bless me. Meaning that I'm, we, gonna, we, can, we gonna do this thing all night long. We gonna do it all night long, but I'm, I'm telling you that I'm not gonna let you go until you bless me. But you gotta, you gotta fight with that thing and tell that thing, you will quit before I quit. You'll give up before I give up. You fight your way through this one, but you do not quit. 
You do not give up on your marriage. Do not quit school. Do not quit on your goal, your dream. You keep going and not just don't quit. We're not talking about not quitting. We're talking about taking the prize home. Let me tell you something, what hurt people do, hurt people, hurt people. Don't even take it personal. When they try to strip you, they're not stripping you because they don't like you. They stripping you because somebody stripped them. Hurt people, hurt people. And so I need you to do me a favor. Never, ever, never, ever, never, ever, never, ever let somebody else, their reality for you, become your reality for you, all right? You ain't no boy no more. This ain't no base. This ain't no, I want to go party. You've given up that right when you had kids. Hey, party's over with out of time. Not time to be partying no more. Now it's time to create a legacy now. You had your fun. Now get your work. Now build a legacy. You don't work for nobody else. You work for your mama. You work for your sister. You work for your aunts. You work for your grandma. You work for your family. You work for your kids. You ain't making no other man rich. You've done some stuff that's so bad that you just put all your dreams down, all your goals down. You've been sleeping, you've been in a state of depression. You you just, you've given up, you've quit. I need you to, I need you to pick that thing back up. I need you to pick it back up. It's okay. We all made mistakes. It's nobody, listen to me, it's nobody that hasn't made a mistake. You've been forgiven. Now you need to forgive yourself. All right, because you're living in the past. You can't get what's next. You can't get your future because you're stuck in your past. I need you to let it go. Listen to me, no man is an island. You cannot do it alone. You do not have to do it alone. Get some help, all right? Get, get I, I call it accountability partners, a board of advisors. Get the right people around you. Third quarter living is about the point of no return. Hear what I'm telling you? Third quarter living is about the point of no return. Like if you gonna quit, that's first quarter living, right? Maybe second, I'm not sure. But I know in the third quarter, look, you, you in it too deep. You too far in it, you too deep in it. You better, you heard me say it before, you better get a reward. I behaved like a child, but when I became a man, I put away childish things, cut it off, cut it off, cut it off, cut her off. So what, she gonna get attitude, cut her off. So what, well, bump your boss, cut your boss off. Your wife needs you, bump your boss. Your boss don't run you. Your boss don't care about your wife and your kids. You care about your wife and kids. Do what you're supposed to do. You ain't no boy no more. You don't need their approval. You're talented enough. God made you. You got everything you need. I want you to spend all your energy on overcoming your weaknesses because behind every weakness you overcome is another level of success. And your goal should be the best human when you die that you could be. So your sons and daughters, when they bury you, should say, that's what I want to be like that. I'm going to take this legacy to the next level.